hello in today's video we are going to look at how to create a splash or a loading screen for our android app in this tutorial we are going to just use a demo application you can see right here and then we are going to create our splash screen so open up the manifest as you can see there is only one activity which is the main activity and it is also the launcher activity now what we are going to do is go to the app then open the java or kotlin folder then go to the last folder here and then we are going to add a new activity and i'm going to use an empty views activity then this activity we will make it the launcher activity so i'm going to call it splash activity and then we'll make it the launcher activity by then toggling this then choose the language i'm going to use java for this tutorial then click finish as we'll see in the manifest this, uh, this splash activity will also have this intent filter so what we will do is to remove the intent filter from the main activity so that we, on we have only one launcher activity so i remove this intent filter from the main activity and exported here can be false since it will only be launched from inside our application now let's go back to the splash act uh, activity layout file i'm going to hide this emulator for now then expand this i open it in a split view then we can design our splash activity so how do you want it to look like? I'm going to use a relative layout. And then inside this relative layout, I will only have one image view. And in this image view, the width will be 200 dp. And the height will also be 200 dp. So it's going to be a square image. And the source, I will use the launch icon just for demonstration purposes so I type put IC launcher and then I will center it in parent okay that is it now we have to go to the splash activity java files to, so that we set up the logic for our splash screen so inside here on, on create method what we are going to do is to create a handler so handler handler is go to new handler so now i will use the handler to make a delay while the splash screen will be visible so handler dot post delayed then inside here i will pass a new runnable Then we override the run method of this handler. But before we do that, let's look at the other things we have to do. So after the runnable, we have to provide um, the delay. So I put a comma here. Then I put the delay I want. I want three seconds. So this splash screen will last about three seconds, and that will be three thousand milliseconds then I end my statement from here okay inside the run method we have to put the code that will be executed after that three seconds so I want to start a new activity which will be the main activity so inside here I'm going to say start activity okay I think start activity start activity Then I create a new intent. Uh, starting from this, which will be splash activity dot this. Then we shall be launching main activity. So main activity dot class. Then we end the statement. Okay, that's it. So now we run our app to see if it is working. Okay.
you can see the splash is now on after three seconds our app opens so that is it for this video if you have any questions leave them in the comment section and if you are new to my channel please subscribe